Hi and welcome to the course Azure Redis Cash. My name is Afzal Ahmed Zishan and I will be your instructor throughout this course. A very simple yet brief introduction of mine would be that I am an author with Pact and I have published some books. I am an MVP at C Sharp Corner, Code Project and Microsoft. And most of the times I am found mentoring the beginners in the computer science field or participating in open source projects. Let's go ahead and take a look at what this course has to offer you in terms of the distributed caching using the Azure Redis Cache service. In the section 1, we will go ahead and take a look at the distributed caching system. We will understand what distributed caching system is, what caching itself means and how Redis as a protocol functions. In the section 2, we will move ahead and take a look at the Azure Redis Cache service as a service for the distributed caching environments. We will take a look at how Azure Redis Cache services can be created. We will also take a look at some of the best practices that we can employ in developing the solutions using Azure Redis Cache service. In section 3, we will go ahead and implement the solutions using Azure Redis Cache service. We will integrate the libraries or the SDKs that we want to and we will try to save some data and extract the data from the Redis Cache service. In section 4, we will go ahead to some of the advanced concepts such as the publish subscribe patterns and we will see how Redis protocol supports and what of the services does Azure Redis Cache service provide us with in order to publish the messages and develop a full featured communication application using WPF framework. In section 5, we will go ahead and discuss another advanced topic which is the clustering of the services. We will take a look at how sharding happens. We will take a look at how Redis automatically uses the keys to generate the tokens and to determine which of the slots of the hashing table can be used to store the information in. In section 6, we will take a look at some of the advanced concepts that Azure as a platform provides to the Redis servers such as the virtual networks, geo replication, data replication and much more. So in this course, we will take a very brief and comprehensive look at the Azure Redis Cache service. The prerequisite for this course are that you must understand the basic concept of a distributed computing environment. You must know what data structures are such as the hashes or the trees. You must also understand what hashing algorithm does. And from there, we will be teaching you about the Azure Redis Cache service and we will train you into developing high performance and efficient solutions using the Azure Redis Cache service so that you can build your own application servers or communication channels using Azure Redis Cache service or any other front-end libraries of your choice. 